Hey loves, today's video is part two of my Bad Habit Aphrodite Fall Makeup Tutorial Series. This is the look that I came up with. I will also be hauling four Nikki K Silky Stick Lipsticks. I'm applying the shade Jealousy in and above my crease using my e.l.f. eye blending brush. I'm applying the shade Heartbreak to the outer third of my lid using my e.l.f. eye crease brush. I'm applying the shade Love to the center of my lid using my Modessa eyeshadow brush. Using that same Modessa eyeshadow brush, I'm now applying the shade Euphoria to the inner third of my lid. I'm highlighting my brow bone with the shade Koi using my Color Mates eyeshadow brush. I'm applying the shade Lust along my lower lash line using my AOA E115. I'm lining my waterline with the Flower Beauty Forever Wear liner in the shade Onyx. Now I'm applying the LA Colors Eye Tensity Amplifying Mascara to my lower lashes. I'm highlighting the inner corner of my eye with the shade Sparks using my e.l.f. Small Smudge Brush. I'm using my Basic Blush Brush to apply the LA Colors Matte Eyeshadow in the shade Forbidden. I'm highlighting with the Babillion Crease Brush. I got it off of the Cute app. And the highlighter is by Maybelline. It is their Master Chrome Metallic Highlighter in the shade Molten Gold. I purchased four of the Nikki K Silky Stick lipsticks from my local beauty supply store for $3 each. I purchased two matte shades and two cream shades, and I think all four colors are perfect for the fall season. The first matte Silky Stick is in the shade Paco, and it's a really pretty deep wine color. The next matte silky stick is in the shade Revolver, and it is a really pretty deep eggplant purple. The first Nikki K cream silky stick is in the shade Totem Pole, which is a really pretty bright red. And the last cream silky stick is in the shade Ciacolato. <laughs> it's Italian for chocolate, I had to Google it. But it's a really pretty reddish brown. I'm applying the Nikki K Matte Silky Stick in the shade Paco. This is my completed fall makeup look number two using the Aphrodite palette by Bad Habit. Don't forget to check the eye at the top right of your screen for part one. All of the products that I used will be listed down below in the description. I think my favorite part of this entire look is that the red on the lid and the red on the lower lash line just really pull the eye together. I would love to know what you thought of this tutorial, so go ahead and drop a comment down below. And until next time, bye loves!